does social media threaten our privacy? In today's world, social media is a huge thing for my generation. We all post a picture or a video from time to time. But are we aware that it can threaten our privacy? It was estimated that 91% of the U.S. population don't read the terms and conditions. If the U.S. has that many people not reading the privacy policy, how about the rest of the world? How about you? Privacy. Well, according to the dictionary, it means the state or condition of being free from being observed or disturbed by other people. It could also mean the state of being free from public attention. We ask people to respect our privacy, but do we respect our own privacy? Do we know when to stop? Have we gone too far? Is it too much information? Aftermaths, robberies, kidnaps, and burglaries. Most of these are linked with exposing too much information on a social media platform. Some even include celebrities. For example, back in 2016, keeping up with the Kardashian star, Kim Kardashian West was robbed, tied up, and held at gunpoint just because she posted about her engagement ring a few hours before. Here's another story. A 16-year-old girl was surprised by her family with tickets to Paris. She posted the tickets, the date and the time of her flight, and other personal information. When she returned home, her family found the house robbed, and all the valuable objects were gone. These stories are only an example of a million other stories around the world. It's disturbing that some stories can get even worse. Some even lead to death. Social media is not always a safe place. To reduce cases like these, I came up with a few solutions that you can follow to protect your privacy. First, I recommend rechecking on what you want to post before actually posting it. Second, if going out or traveling, be sure to do something called late post, meaning you post after coming home from the trip. Third, always read the privacy policy rule and follow the rules. Fourth, be selective with friend requests. Fifth, protect your identity. And last but not least, be aware of what you are posting. Make sure it doesn't disturb your privacy or be too personal. So in conclusion, yes, social media can threaten our privacy. If we're not aware of what we post or how much we expose ourselves to the media, it's time to keep us safe. My name is Nalini Mamuli Austin Thank you for listening.